Hi, I'm Daniel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add motion blur inside of DaVinci Resolve. So we're going to work inside of the edit tab. And let's say you have this clip and you've made this really cool speed ramp. So drive here and you have a speed ramp like that. And you want to add some motion blur. The first and quickest way to do it is just to head inside of the color tab. So you mark the clip you want to add motion blur to. And you go down to the color tab. And down here, you have to press this icon here, that icon there, motion effects, and then you have motion blur here. So you can pull that all the way up to 100, head back to the edit tab, and you will have a result looking like this. So you can see that is much more jittery. This is a smooth motion blur. You can see, for example, that car here, smooth motion blur, and if you compare that to over here, it hasn't, it doesn't have any motion blur at all. So usually that will make the trick of adding the motion blur effect that you want, clean, subtle, but maybe you would like to have a beefier effect. Maybe you would like to have more motion blur. So then what you do is you go down to the effects tab. So make sure you have effects marked here. And you go down to the effects tab here and you pull out an adjustment clip. Pull that out and then you mark this adjustment clip and you go down here to fusion. And you have the media in node marked here and you press shift space and you search for motion trails. And you have motion trails here, add. And you have motion trails here. And then you can choose trail length up here in the inspector tab. And the trail length will further affect the motion blur. So let's say you have just a trail length of one and you go to edit and you pull this adjustment clip over to your speed ramp effect here. And now you have a very beefy uh, motion blur, okay? And you can add the effects even more to, let's say, three. And here you have really, really a lot of motion blur. So maybe this will suit some of your speed ramps or projects. And it's a really good tool to know about. So that is two ways to add motion blur to your clips inside of DaVinci Resolve. I hope you found this video to be helpful. And if you did like this video, maybe you'll like one of my other ones.